Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today, we're going to be taking a look at four gadgets which really, really need a nerf in the upcoming Brawler Days update because they are just so, so OP right now. But before we get into it, we're going to pick up this new Kony Max skin. And of course, if you're picking up anything in the shop, make sure to put code Tom over in the right side of the store here. So you can support me when you spend like any gems at all. So yeah, let's pick up this Kony Max skin. By the way, I really, really recommend picking up this skin because it is so, so nice. And you guys already know we had to test out this Kony Max skin. Before we get into the main part of the video, I tested it a little bit in training cave and it's it's so so nice okay it's it's my favorite max skin by a long long way like it <laughs> i love the emotes every time you um shoot similar to also other line skins as well but yeah everything about this skin is just so so nice i cannot wait for um the other line skins i think there's one more to come into the game this bull's trying to dodge but honestly we could just ultimate him i don't know what he's doing oh my god nice you see when you use your super there's like uh loads of like it's like go 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 little text comes out it's just so nice it's such a nice skin but yeah seven cubes there seven people left we are kind of wrecking right now not gonna lie oh my okay <laughs> why did no one get any of these cubes like we're just grabbing every single cube on the map right now and i love it because we have 10 cubes right now <laughs> um okay let's try and find some people i guess carl is down here with seven cubes okay what are you doing, Carl? Can I actually grab a little bit of our super probably? Let's see if Carl. Yeah. What are you doing, Carl? <laughs> 13 cubes. We have literally just wrecked this entire lobby right now. Okay, there should be an 8 bit in this bush up here, I believe. Oh, it's a max. Okay. Use that to get a bit closer there. Okay. Ooh, okay. Nice kill there. 16 cubes. <laughs> Not even any bosses or any like any bots to get cubes off and we've still got 16 cubes that's crazy okay let's try and find this last person it's just a mortis okay mortis is just <laughs> no surprise mortis is just running into the zone there but yeah that's gonna be a win with the coney max okay so the first gadget which definitely deserves enough in this upcoming update is that this cult one so it's very op it does 3k damage and it can go through walls and it has the same range of a cult just a normal cult shot but yeah it's pretty crazy. I think like a little damage nerf. It's not as good as the other, um, the other gadgets I'd say, but it still definitely deserves a nerf um, because yeah, it is very very strong. The ability to shoot for a wall and do three k damage to someone is uh, pretty crazy. But we're gonna miss that there. As you can see, it's not the easiest gadget to actually hit as well, so it doesn't need a huge nerf. Just a little bit of a nerf. Here we can see Primos getting their super off each other, which we absolutely hate to see. So, yeah, let's just go and finish these primos here. <laughs> we don't want none of this team in our lobby, not gonna lie. Okay, we just completely missed that. Let's uh, let's forget about that. But, yeah, this gadget definitely not that easy to hit. So, it doesn't need a huge nerf. Maybe just, like, a small damage nerf would be pretty good for this gadget. And, by the way, the update, um, it, like, watching all the YouTubers' videos, it looks like the update's coming out sometime this weekend. Um, Ray made a really good video on it, and so did uh, Corey about the reasons why it's, it should be on the 12th or just sometime this weekend or maybe if we're unlucky maybe like early next week but we will have to see okay gonna <laughs> 4.7k it actually scales up with the with power cube so it's really good in showdown as well this gadget yeah everything points to the update being sometime this weekend or maybe um like early next week but or the brutal talk anyway being this weekend or early next week and then the update dropping kind of just next week so yeah i'm definitely really excited for everything that's going to be coming in this update because this is probably going to be one of the a pretty big update i'd say because we haven't had an update in what five five weeks something like that so yeah i'd say it's expect a, a decent sized update here but yeah i'm really excited let me know what you guys are most excited for um i'd have to say I'm always excited to see if there's a, a club war feature. I know it's I know it's really difficult for the team and I hope they just take their time and make sure it's a good feature rather than one that they just rush. But yeah, they, they always do that. They'll make it a good feature, but I hope that we get in this club feature sometime because honestly, I feel like when this club feature comes, the game will be so, so insane. Uh, because at the moment, there's not even really a reason to be in clubs. But yeah, we're going to pick up the win here. Uh, let's find out what the next gadget is. Okay, so the next gadget... That of course needs enough says Carl one. Carl's actually the best brawler in the game right now, just solely because of this gadget. Carl's already obviously pretty good um, in terms of probably he was like top ten 
But yeah, he went straight to top one as soon as this gadget came out. Because it's just genuinely very, very OP. And it allows you to get close to people. And if you use it at the right time, you can just wreck pretty much every single brawler in the game. You saw I used a lot in the World Cup um, or the World Finals. Because, yeah, it's just such a good gadget. You're going to use it just to get away here, get better positioning. You can actually pinch these two tanks here with this B. But, yeah, it looks like that. <laughs> Looks like we're just going to grab all of these. Okay, Primo's jumping away then. Maybe we can actually grab some of these cubes. B, I think B picked up a kill. Okay. We're just going to try and get our super of this Shelly right now. Not really sure what, where like everyone else is in the lobby. I think everyone's just chilling right now. Not going to lie. May super us here. Okay, let's get away. <laughs> it's just so good. This gadget is just so good. Whether it's getting close to people, getting away, getting away the gems, making flashy plays in Brew Ball. Um, just whatever. It's such a good gadget. But as you can see, there's a ton of tanks teaming right now. Which you hate to see. But yeah, it's so good for so many different reasons. In Siege as well, getting that first ball, it's very, very good at. So, there's literally, you know, it's so good for moving around. And there's so many uses for that in the different modes. But, anyway. It's pretty much all in there. I don't know. Okay, apparently not. Let's try and get this ball then. Um, okay, bull is weak. Is that bull even maxed? Oh, it, yeah, he is. Um, <laughs> okay, well, this is pretty tough when there's a lot of teaming going on. Well, we can actually use our gadget to reposition ourselves if we need to. We're going to sit in the mid right now. I don't think there's anyone here. Okay, yeah, that bull is dead. Shelly is going down here. I'm going to shoot this bee. Ah, this is bad. Nope. We got the B though, we got the B. But yeah, not much could do, there's a lot of teaming there. Let's hop into the next gadget. Okay, so the next gadget then, of course, has to be this Brock one. I did a video on it as soon as it dropped and I just knew it would change the meta and change um, like pretty much everything in the game. And of course it has Brock, it's probably the second best brawl in the game. Um, but yeah, Brock is absolutely insane right now. The 3k shot, it doesn't go through walls like Colts, but the radius is a lot bigger. Um, which really really helps you hitting those shots. We see a ton of bees playing this map right now. Okay, we just missed <sighs> Call me chief pat for missing my rockets, but we should have probably hit out there. Okay, let's try and get this primo right now Why are we missing so many rockets? What was ha what's happened to us? Okay, we need to focus up here because we are we are missing way too many rockets right now Okay <laughs> This like ah, this card is being annoying it does the, you can actually get damage through walls, but yeah, that, that wall right there would be too much. I think just one wall you can do damage through, but it'd be too much to go through all of there. Okay, how oh, do you want to kill him? He's literally one shot. No? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Why do you not kill him? Like, I get your teaming, but when it's like two free cubes at the end of the day, you got to take it, you know? Also, we're getting pinched right now. Where's this B? Okay, the B's going around here. Let's try and pinch this B, I guess. Hmm, what is even happening? Okay, we need one shot to super and then we can wreck this B. B is using this gadget right now, so yeah, let's just dip and then uh, wait for this gadget to be over. We actually picked up our super. We're gonna super B. B is so annoying. We just, okay, we only hit one shot. Pretty bad from us. Nice, okay. Of course, B has honeycoat, but at least we got that honeycoat down. No way this B is surviving right now. We can go the kill as well, that's nice, okay. We just missed. What, why are we missing so many rockets right now? Bruh. Okay, looks like everyone's teaming. We couldn't even get a call, but we're still going to get fourth place there. This Brock gadget is OP. Okay, so of course, you guys, if you haven't seen it enough, this video, the last gadget, which definitely needs enough, is this B gadget. It's so good. <laughs> it's, I'd say it's probably the best gadget I've, out of all the ones in this video. But yeah, B. Already getting hit there. We tried to use our gadget. Let's see. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. I swear. Oh my god. Okay. Well, let's just leave that be alone right now. But yeah, this gadget is so good. Goes through walls. Obviously, increases um, in damage as the radius of the the gadget increases up to like 1,000. So the maximum you can do with it is 3,000. But if you think about that in a three v three game, the maximum you can do is 9,000 altogether on every single enemy, which is just it's just so much damage for one gadget. Um, so yeah, it's just super OP right now. The B is probably the third best brawler in the meta right now. Just pretty much because of this gadget. Like, B was already okay. Let's uh, pop this gadget right here. 
Primo's gonna go for us, but yeah, no, no hope for the Primo when we have this gadget and we completely counter him there. Yeah, B is just so good. I think they just need to reduce the damage, maybe. Reduce the, the maximum radius, maybe, a little bit. But yeah, just one of the two. Don't know if it too much. You still want to be a decent gadget. So yeah, just to probably nerf one of the two. So either the radius or just the actual damage of the gadget. And uh, everything should be pretty balanced after that, I'd say. Okay, we're going to go down here. Oh, Primo? What are you doing? <laughs> okay, we still have a honeycoat, luckily. So we won't die straight away. Yeah, I was going to say, BB better pick up that kill right there. Why is every B teaming on us? What have I done? What, what have I done to deserve this? I think this B is just going to kill us uh, using the gadget. But yeah, that just shows you the gadget's OP. Everyone left right now is a B because B is super OP. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's going to wrap it up. Okay, guys, well, that's going to wrap it up for the video. The update is probably dropping very soon. So I'm super excited for it. Definitely let me know what you guys are excited for down below. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.